Day two of the Hawaiian adventure. I got some matcha. Heidi got a coffee latte something. And we got four crazy donuts. Well, we got off the bus when the app told us to get off the bus. Turns out we could have got like eight more stops in before getting off. So we literally hiked almost a mile and a half just to get to the trail to hike some more to this waterfall. I'm dying. Heidi has nothing to say on this trip. Nothing? No. Oh. This is her dream trip. She has nothing to say, but we're going to see the waterfall. And nobody's here, just us. And I'm going to fall. You don't want to see a wallaby. What'd you see, Hyde? You really want that to go on the vlog? No. Heidi was just talking about wanting to see a wallaby or some sort of animal. And like two seconds later. We saw a wallaby. We see a wallaby. <laughs> We're making our way down this really muddy and slippery trail to get this, this waterfall that uh, we can swim in. And uh, it's like really slippery right next to the edge of this big old hill or whatever you want to call it. If you're looking for a nice easy hike, this is not it. Um, this would probably be one of the most rugged hikes I've done. Quite muddy. A lot of, a lot of trees to dive under. A lot of wet. But we're doing it like a champ. We've been walking for an hour and a half three miles distance and we can finally hear the waterfall getting really close
Well, that hike is definitely worth the views and uh, the ability to swim in a waterfall. It was super fun, but it was freezing. The water was very cold. Um, I don't think it was salty because I didn't taste no salt. So that's, that's a plus. I didn't drown. It was fun, definitely worth the crazy hike, but now we have to hike back through it. Let's go! Gee, B. Well, we made it off the trail, heading back to the bus stop. We've been walking for about an hour, distance of two miles. Uh, and the bus does not show up for another like hour and a half, hour and 15 minutes. So I don't know what we're gonna do. Heidi just wants to pay the $40 for an Uber. It's worth it. <laughs> I do not wanna spend $40 on an Uber. We made it to the bus stop. We have about an hour wait still, but we are stuck in like a really nice neighborhood. So it won't be too bad. Got a huge bag of uh, goodies, food, from LL Barbecue Hawaiian something. Now we're gonna go sit on the beach. I think you're gonna be full. I got a barbecue beef mix. I got a bunch of random stuff, some macaroni salad rice, lettuce. We got some masubis. It's like a rice cake with spam and seaweed. Heidi got orange chicken because she can't try nothing new. I'm from Indiana, okay. That's Chinese. And this is our view. First time ever having Spam. It's pretty good. A lot of rice in it though. It's kind of good. She likes the Masubi. We finished our sunset date eating our food, watching the sunset, watching all the funny beach people, and uh, and we made a few TikToks, kinda. <laughs> Just about as good as our vlogs, but we had fun. It was a great night. Very short winded. <laughs> <laughs> I brought some tasty cliff bars to fuel my body during this hike. So that was so creepy. She said I cannot put that in the vlog. Brought a cliff bar. Heidi said it's not to fuel my body. What am I supposed to say? I brought a cliff bar to eat. Cliff Bar, sponsor me.